Lawrence. Let me find that one. I have a bunch. Okay. This one is still in the box. We haven't burned this one yet. Look at the size of this candle. It is the same size as this one. But you can actually, like, see now how big it is. Like, this thing is freaking huge. And I love it. It's Wild Peonies and Lily. These are all soy candles. I don't know if I mentioned that, but they're soy candles. Whew, I've got to breathe. I also need to talk a little slower. That's, that's probably my problem. Okay. Um, it says, slowed by a thousand-year-old cobblestones, just stroll with time and spare through streets, <laughs> and spare through streets rich with history and warm Florentine air. Peonies, amber, and lily mingle under the Tuscan sun, and you see the beauty where the spirit of the Renaissance lives on. So that's a little description of what you are going to feel when you light this candle. Whew. I, I'm sorry. I, I'm so out of breath. Okay. I already did open it though. <laughs> Just going to say that I did open it and smell it. It says prevent soot from forming on glass. Oh, by keeping the wicks trimmed. Okay. So that's what happened to this jar over here. We did not trim the wicks. So it doesn't have to be that dirty. You guys, you just have to be responsible and you know, trim your wicks. Oh my gosh, I can smell this candle and all I did was open the box. I haven't even opened it like all the way. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. This is going to be like my spring candle. I'm going to go to this. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing. I'm going to go to this in the spring. Oh, I was thinking about gifting some of these candles for Christmas, but I think I'm going to hang on to them. I think I might have to be selfish with them and be like, I'm sorry, these just smell too amazing. I can't give them up. But here's a size reference. Here's how much is in here when you have a lit, <laughs> when you have a lit. Um, we burn ours for several, several hours. Um, and I've been burning it for probably two months now. And that candle's still not empty. So these last, I feel like they last forever. They're just amazing. Um, this one smells really good. This one is, like I said, more of a springtime candle. It's wild peonies and lily. And you can see how beautiful the jar is when it's not all dirty. How gorgeous would this look on your, like, countertop filled with, like, powdered sugar ready for you to make some cookies or something? I don't know. Super pretty. I love it. Packaging is adorable. Um, I'm going to slide this back into there, though, just in case I do decide to be nice and gift it, even though I don't want to. Um, so I'm just going to package that back up. But yeah, it's amazing. This candle right here is like 26 ounces, too, or something like that. Something insane. Yeah, 26.8 ounces. I can't believe that. Oops, I did not close it properly. There we go. But anyway, seriously, overall, it's amazing. I have a couple more I want to talk to you about. I hope you're not annoyed. This is a candle review after all. So this one is Tales of Coney Island. 